Rubber Duck is visiting Maryland in the US, and fans are driving for miles to see her. Amber Mundy's excited that the ducks come so near to her home. I'm here to see the giant duck. I love ducks because I collect them. And so I wanted to see it for the first time because I've already seen it like growing up. And so like I was like, oh, I want to see it for real now. And it came to Maryland. So I was going to go to Toronto to see it, but I'm glad it came here. The yellow rubber duck has fans of all ages. David Lewis and his wife have driven almost 100 miles for rubber duck. It's a once in a lifetime opportunity to go see this duck. I've never seen it before, never heard about it. Okay? We drove 91 miles one way just to come see the duck in beautiful Leonard Town, Maryland. Okay? The huge rubber duck was created by a Dutch artist called Florentine Hoffman. Since visiting its first city in 2007, the yellow duck has been on a world tour. Hoffman makes a new rubber duck in every new city because he thinks of it as street art. It requires a sewing machine and putting 200 pieces of plastic together by hand. The duck has a fan in it to blow it up. All the rubber ducks are different in size, but they always attract large crowds. I'm looking at it now and it's definitely a lot bigger than I expected and it's, it's really cool. The rubber duck's 20 years old and has a lot of followers who grew up with her. It's been Emily Ducky Donahue's dream to meet her. I've been wanting to see this duck for as long as I can remember. My sister showed me a picture of this like when I was maybe like 11 years old and since then I've been wanting to see this duck for so long because I've been in love with ducks since I was just like so little and this is like a dream come true. <laughs> Let's see where Rubber Duck visits after Maryland. <laughs> 